With our one-of-a-kind teleoperated walking excavator, we can perform dangerous operations without putting any operator into harm's way. A good example for such an operation would be working below dangerous rockfall area. 5G communication plays an important role in that. Today is the first time that we connect our teleoperated walking excavator to our teleoperation base station using 5G. In order to send the images from four cameras, a laser scanner and multiple other sensors to our remote operator station through 5G, we had to mount a 5G antenna on the roof of the excavator and put a router inside. From the excavator to our operator station, we transmit four camera streams and this is about 50 megabits per second average and this is happening over 5G networks to provide high bandwidth and low latency for our operator station. In order to demonstrate the efficiency of our mobile network and especially the 5G technology, we were forced to bring the best mobile network to the ETH campus. At the excavator area, we put temporarily a 5G mobile container in service, which provides prioritized bandwidth required for the remote steering. It looks that everything is working fine and we are ready for the test. Let's see how it goes. In comparison to our earlier tests using 4G, Today, with 5G, we can achieve lower latencies and also higher bandwidth. A lower latency is beneficial because we can easier and faster teleoperate the machine, whereas with the higher bandwidth, we can transmit higher resolution images um, that look overall a lot better for the operator. Excellent experience. Everything is new and we're doing things the first time. It's uh, quite inspiring to, to, to work together with the, with the people from the ETH. So these tests are the initial 5G communication uh, implementation. We made it here as a prototype, but we want to push it further for multiple machines, for example, in a real construction environment. So this is only like one single machine demonstration, but we want to extend this later on for multiple machines work in a real, real environment. Mm, la, la, la.